Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kelly with On My Way and this is week 10 of the Journey to Health collab where a bunch of us YouTubers are answering a series of 12 questions, one per week, and uh, definitely check out their links below if you haven't already. Um, they have some great insight on the answers to these questions and uh, let them know that I sent you and give them a follow. So, this week, the question is, what is your favorite type of exercise? And out of all the questions in this series so far, this one was pretty much the toughest because it's hard for me to pick my favorite. I really liked Keto with Mitch's answer where he's like, my favorite exercise would be nothing. But um, in all honesty, if you are on a journey to get healthy, it is important to find a type of exercise that you enjoy and that can keep you motivated and help you to achieve your goals. And everyone's goals are different and there's so many different types of exercise out there. I will start by saying that when I re-energized, shall we say, my weight loss journey this time around uh, in spring of this year, I was in a lot of pain. I had let everything that I'd built up in my life, fitness-wise, kind of atrophy. And I was in a lot of pain. There was chronic pain, aches, and just joints were achy, and I was miserable, and I very low energy, and tired all the time. And so when I realized that I wanted to get back into it, I knew I was going to need to become more active. And because of the, the soreness that I had, I started with yoga. And I found uh, Yoga with Adrienne here on YouTube, and I'll include her link below. And I just started doing her videos, first to kind of loosen things up and help me feel better and less sore and more comfortable. And then I was able to add in more intense yoga workouts of hers that are specifically targeted for weight loss and strengthening your muscles. And when I used to think about yoga, I didn't think that that aspect of it was a possibility, but it really definitely is. And you know, she's got a lot of great videos that you can do for any type of situation, whether it is to relax or to take care of some sore muscles and issues that you may have to uh, strengthening your muscles and getting a good burn for weight loss. Um, and so then once I felt better, then I started adding back in uh, running or jogging shall we say and I had previously had a history with CrossFit and so that's another one that I really enjoy uh, it's kind of a love-hate relationship if any of you are familiar with CrossFit um, it's really good in terms of motivating you there's a lot of energy in that type of environment with the people around you and your coaches but there can be feelings of dread like what's it gonna be today what what am I gonna have to do? Am I gonna be able to do it? So that was another of my favorites. And I also just like doing videos too, like the beach body ones, like size, where you're actually doing dancing, which I never thought that I would ever do, but it's fun. Also just traditional weight training at the gym. I used to always think that if I was gonna lift weights, I was going to bulk up too much and you know, and it wasn't gonna be good, but I've since learned the error of that train of thinking in knowing that lifting weights is actually very beneficial on a weight loss or a fitness journey. The more muscle you have, the better you're able to, to burn the fat that you have, even long after you've concluded your weightlifting session. So, like I said, it's hard to pick a favorite because I like to do a lot of different things for different reasons. Um, I started back with yoga, I added in some running and some jogging, um, I'm now doing a lot of long distance walking, and I do like to do traditional weight training and CrossFit. So if I had to pick a favorite, I really don't want to. It's really tough. I'm not going to pick a favorite. I'm going to... I'm gonna go outside the mold of this question and I'm just gonna say 
experiment with lots of different kinds of exercise and find out what works best for you mentally, emotionally, and what makes you feel good. And don't be afraid to try a lot of different things to keep the variety because that really, if that's something that you need, then it is important to have that variety. Some people just like to do the same thing and that's what works for them, but don't be afraid to try a lot of different things to get that variety because the most important thing is to keep going and to stay motivated. And so basically do whatever you can to keep that motivation and that drive up so that you can progress and achieve the goals that you have. I'm grateful for the opportunity that I have to be a part of this collaboration and to have answered this question for you today. Like I said before, make sure you check out the other videos from the collaborators. They have wonderful insights on the questions that we're discussing in this series. And if you are new to my channel, welcome. And uh, if you are a returning subscriber, thank you for being here again. And make sure you like the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel so that you can follow me along as I am in the process of losing 100 pounds. Thanks so much for watching. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.